thing you can do is screen record. So what we can do is we can make our way over to our settings application like we did before, swipe down, and what we wanna do is we wanna get into the control center of our iPad. So we wanna click on control center right here. And now what we wanna do is we wanna add the screen recording toggle right here. So I already added it, but I'll go ahead and just take it out. So what we wanna do is we wanna swipe down. We'll see the screen recording toggle right here. You wanna go ahead and click on that plus button right next to screen recording. And as long as you see it right there, you should be good to go. So now come back in your home screen or whatever else you wanted to screen record, and you wanna swipe down from the top right. So when you swipe down from the top right, you'll get into your control center. Now, right when you swipe down from the top in general, you'll come back into your lock screen. We already kind of went over this, but what we can do is swipe down from the top right and we'll see our control center. Now, a quick breakdown of this, you'll see your Wi-Fi cell signal up here, any music you're playing right here, your screen rotation. So if you want to turn it off from the, or switching to the side, you can do that. Screen mirroring, do not disturb with focus mode built in, which is really cool. Your display setting, so you can increase and decrease the brightness. Your sound setting, so you can increase or decrease the sound, but also our control toggles down here. Now we want to screen record. So this is the screen recording toggle we just added. So we can go ahead and click on that. It's gonna count down from three, as you can see. And once it turns like that, and once it, that little red thing comes at the top right, you will pretty much be able to start screen recording. So we can go ahead and screen record whatever we were going to do, it doesn't really matter. Whenever you're done wanting to screen record, you can click on the top right again. So click there, click stop, and that recording will now be saved into your Photos application. So now what we can do is go and click on our Photos app like this. We can swipe to the side, and you will see that screen recording that we just did right there. So just like any other photo or application or image or whatever, we can click here and we can go and click on that share button right here. And we can share this out to whoever we want to message it to people, whatever the case is, a very easy process. And just like every other application, we swipe up and we can come back home. So that's pretty much a quick breakdown, a quick process of this specific, you know, iPad 9th generation. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully you know a little bit more about this iPad. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.